Christmas, everyone. I uh, hope you have a great day tomorrow, whatever you get up to. I guess probably for many of us, it'll be a very different day to one that we've been used to. Perhaps as we think back of uh, plans that we would have had for Christmas or the ways that we've celebrated it in the past, tomorrow will be different. But I suspect for lots of us, that sort of raises the question, well, what, what really is Christmas all about? If it's not about a big event, what is Christmas about? Is it about the turkey? Is it about the, the mulled wine, the mince pies? Is it about family presents, Santa? Well, at the heart of Christmas is Christ. That's why it's called Christmas, it's not called Santamus. It's called Christmas because Jesus is at the heart of it all. Now, uh, when the Apostle John uh, writes his account of Jesus' life, uh, John says that Jesus is like the sort of revelation of God, the word of God, the communication, the way that God reveals and speaks. He says this, the word became flesh and made his dwelling among us. We have seen his glory, the glory of the one and only son who came from the father full of grace and truth. Jesus is full of grace. He is totally gracious, kind, merciful, generous, compassionate. And he shows that by the fact that he's coming to the world. He was born at Christmas time uh, to forgive us of our sins, to die on the cross for all that we've done wrong and to connect us back to God. If you're on the naughty list this year, there is no lump of coal for you. Jesus offers forgiveness. He offers mercy and kindness. He's full of grace, but he's also full of truth. You see, that message of uh, being forgiven by God is a true message. It may sound like it's too good to be true, knowing all that you've done can be forgiven, can be cleansed, can be wiped clean. You can have freedom from the guilt and the mistakes of your past. That message is true because Jesus reveals truth. He's full of truth. There's no fake news, no alternative facts when it comes to Jesus. His message is true. And so that means that this Christmas, you can receive that message of forgiveness for yourself. You may have loads of questions. You may have loads of things you want to think through a bit more. We'd love to help you as a church. Please get in contact with us if we can help in any way, answer any questions that you have. But you know enough. If you've heard this message, if you've been watching some of our other videos, you'll know enough to trust Jesus. You may have questions and how it all fits together and how it all works out. But this Christmas, if you turn to Jesus, if you receive him and accept the forgiveness that he offers, you can know the assurance of forgiveness of all that you've done wrong and hope. Hope for the future, hope of eternal life with God through Jesus who came into the world full of grace and full of truth. So why not receive that for yourself this Christmas? It will be the best decision you ever make.